I'm Rachel Trezise, I'm the script writer. I'm Rhiannon White and I'm co-artistic director of Commonwealth. I'm Evie Manning and I'm co-artistic director of Commonwealth. Our uh, process always begins in the heart of places with real people in real time. So we began this process by interviewing people who work in the steelworks, people who are union members, who run the, um, the community union, and built a picture of the landscape of Port Talbot, who lives there, what's going on for people there, and how they're kind of taking their place in the world now with the Save Our Steel Company. I'm Colly Thiare, and I'm the Artistic Director and Chief Executive of National Theatre Wales. Wales has got an extraordinary history of extraordinary people who've stood up for big ideas and made significant marks in the history of the nation and we wanted to look at a piece of work that captured what's con what was contemporary and happening now in places that have ha had huge significant impact on the country. My name is Jason May and I've been looking at the character Rob. There were themes there that related so much to me because I come from a working class background. I've worked in that environment and looking at the script and seeing those things, they're so reflective of the things I went through when I was working in that industry. So. We're looking at politics as a grand scale, you know, the grand narrative, but actually what happens to the everyday people who are on the ground working in the steelworks, who run the cafes, what is that feeling that's there in this uncertain time and how can we reclaim ourselves in, in uncertainty and that's kind of what we want to achieve in this play is not just bringing the actors together or the, the themes together but bringing the audience together in that moment to feel what happens when we really are like shoulder to shoulder.